Good morning, Brandon Bonderford on Focus. And today we are northeast of the village of Bruce in Ross County at the intersection of County A and Bass Lake Road here. I just finished meeting with Mike Hansen, who trains professional horses here on this road. And last night, you can see he experienced a life-threatening event. National Weather Service confirmed the tornado moved through this area on Monday evening. Shortly after 7.20, the tornado moved through this area and caused some damage. Talking to Mike, him and his family were in the house at the time, and they looked outside to the south, and they saw this funnel cloud. As you can see from the footage here, the wind really started to pick up rather quick. Mike said it was only a matter of minutes that the storm moved through, but within that time, it felt like forever. As the wind picked up, the Hanson family sprung into action, going outside to rescue their animals that were in their arena. While in the arena, they were able to bring the animals into their stalls, but Mike was in the arena when the roof came off of their barn. Looking at the barn, two segments of the roof were peeled back, one going on one side and one going on the other side of the barn. Many of the residents in the area here lost power at the time of the storm. The local fire department worked to remove downed trees so that power could be restored. The Hanson family told me that their power came on just shortly after 11 p.m. last night. Speaking to the Hanson family this morning, they're definitely shooken up by the incident, but thankful that it wasn't more tragic. I'm Brandon Bonderfer on County A, northeast of the village of Bruce with On Focus. Stay tuned as we continue to cover more of the news that matters to you.